to give with Nathan but I think I'm gonna just put them on a to buy list because I didn't get the cherries or the shark sleeper um, just because I really want to like make sure before I spend money they weren't expensive I think that they were like four fifty or five dollars but I did get this little bib because I just couldn't resist obviously we love Disney um, but yeah so I got this to put in with how I tell Nate I don't have work until 9 this morning and Nate is off today. So basically, here's the thing. I think that I could possibly be pregnant even though the digital test said not pregnant. But the first response is six days sooner than your missed period, which today would be that, I think. Because I think I'm scheduled to get my period on the 17th. So the 18th would be my missed period. So I'm six days out from missing my period. I'm five days out from when I'm scheduled to get my period. Um, and the digital ones only show five days from your missed period. So I'm just, I'm thinking that maybe it was just too early to take a digital one. Um, if that's the case, I would just buy new ones. Um, I have one more digital one, and then I have another clear blue one that is not digital. It's just like it does like a plus or mine or just a line. So I think tomorrow I'll definitely take a first response because that's what I saw a line on today, and I'll probably take the Walmart one tomorrow. I took one of those, but they were from the dollar store. It's like the same thing. It literally is probably the same as like the HCG strips that I got on Amazon. But like I said, I wasn't really happy with those because like my whole tracking my ovulation, it never, the line never got darker than the control line. Like it got darker but not as dark as the control or darker than the control so I was like really like freaking out about that um and that's why I bought the clear blue ones and that one you know Okay, 
So it's 9.45 and I'm back out. I left work really quick. Pick up the onesie. It's already done. It's so cute. So, oh my God. So this was the first one I took that I swore I saw a line and like, I guess you can kind of see it, but like it's barely there. And then I took this one last night and you can see it more. This was this morning, which you can definitely see. And then this is right now. So, I definitely think that I'm pregnant. Good morning guys, it is Friday. I am 11 DPO and it's Valentine's Day. Um, I made it down to the basement, as you can see. It is getting remodeled. There is a bathroom, but I peed upstairs. So I have my pee and then I have three tests. They have the regular first response, a digital clear blue, and then the digital first response. So I'm going to take those. I just hope I get a positive. Okay. There's like nine seconds left on my timer. My coffee is still brewing, so I came down, but I'm so nervous. Okay, so I'm confused. So this one, There's a line. Okay. So there's definitely a line on this one. Like there's been for the past few days. You can see that. And then this first response. Yes. I'm the blue says no. <laughs> I think I'm pregnant. <laughs> Okay, so I made this for the beginning of the year just because I knew we were going to start trying, so it's perfect. This is from our shower, which is so cute, and it's root beer. And then these I got at Target Dollar Spot a while ago. This is just for the picture, but it is actual beer. <laughs> 
This is the onesie from Old Navy. Yes. And then the bib, the card, and then this little onesie. 